Hello and welcome to Advanced Mazda. It's at a track I own this week. I'm always wanting to do Advanced Mazda, but uh, I don't own all too many road uh, road courses, so I often am not able to participate, and then the weeks where I could, I just don't get around to it, so uh, I'm actually able to do it this week because Summit Point is a free track, so we're going to come out to uh, qualifying here. We are the number three. Um, actually, not too many people signed up, interestingly enough. I um, thought we'd have a lot more people, but I guess it is late at night. But then again, that usually doesn't matter because, well, it's late at night in the United States, but not anywhere else. And road racing is popular everywhere. In fact, I am the only person from the United States in this uh, lobby. I don't know if it's single split or if it's split once, but it, I don't think it's split more than once. Either way, we are the number three. So we do have a couple of guys. It's a higher I rating. Are you going to show us how it's done? <laughs> But it's uh, pretty convenient because Rookie Mazda is at the same track this week. And so I already did a race there. I always try to get the rookie races, the rookie uh, road races in each week because I need all the practice I can get. And uh, I ended up with runner up in that, so that felt pretty good against a guy that uh, had like, like 6,000 road I rating. And I was only a second behind him at the end, so that's okay, actually pretty. <laughs> that felt pretty good. But uh, I'm not sure I'm able to get all the speed I need to get out of the car with the open setup. I'm giving it my best, but. Ooh, I could push that a lot harder. Should have all time optimal up, honestly. Although that might be affected by. Draft. Well, that wasn't optimal. <laughs> it's awkward. That way I took that corner. But the uh, tires aren't quite up to temp yet either, so it is what it is, and I'm never quite that good on the cold tires. Well, we'll just see what we can do here. Not feeling too confident about my uh, effort so far, though. All time best is a 125, as in 120.5. Mm. Oh god, I got a terrible run of the line, too. I feel like I'm just blowing it. I feel like I could do so much better. I'm just messing with this all up. So let's go back to uh, session optimal, see if we can at least just make the... do better the next lap, because that was terrible. I just want to have a better lap this time around. Very unhappy with a 122.3. Still not great through there. I'm not brave enough for that corner in a lake. Okay, feeling a little bit better this lap so far. I feel like I'm sliding just a little bit too much, though. I feel like I could be smoother. Put the wheel back on the desk. Thank you. I didn't completely mess that up. So, at least we'll be in the 121s, it looks like. What we got? 121.9. Just barely. Ugh. Still feel like I... Let's do a little bit better than that. 
I know I can get in the 120s, that's why I'm disappointed. Of course, I gotta remember that I'm... I didn't bother taking the fuel out of it or anything, so... I'm driving around here with the race fuel. Whereas others might be doing queue setups and everything, because this is also just the race setup. I'm just not bothering with any of that other stuff. So. I just hope we are able to not get stuck behind people too much at the start or get run over. I don't know exactly what to expect from the other drivers here. Hopefully, reasonable driving. I hope. I think these races are, what, like usually 20 minutes long? Uh, Summit Point's not my best track either, so I keep that in mind as well. Not to uh, get too excited. <laughs> we'll get this ready for later. How much time we got? Not too much, I imagine. We got the 7 and the 12 we're apparently waiting for. 12's just doing nothing. 7's just doing nothing. They just want to make us wait, I guess. Like I said, the only person from the United States in here today. Oh my gosh, six incidents already. Five? Probably sliding off the track, I guess, on the cold tires trying to get everything. Oh. So the, the 12 decided to hit the button. Oh, are you kidding me? Cancel due to activity? Who's doing it? Are you just now going out there? Man, why you gotta do this to us? You don't even have enough time to do a lap. Just hit the button. <laughs> Gosh. Oh, well, I guess we're waiting another minute and five. I thought we were about ready to go. But, uh, I'm feeling like I could be faster. Some of the points, not too bad of a track for the Mazdas, though. Um, get a little bit of draft from the front stretch and all that, but it's not a huge draft fest like some other tracks, so. Don't mind this place all too much. We're too far off from the leader, just about half a second. So we could potentially keep up with the main pack. We'll see. 35 minutes. I think I might have said 20 minutes earlier. We are. It's a 35 minute race. We'll have plenty of racing to do. Got all of our fuel in there. Seven has successfully made us wait. But it is time now. Can't delay it anymore. Kazuki, we are racing. All right. Well, you know, not racing, but gritting. Guess we'll put up uh, all time best. Uh, initially, I'll probably switch it to session optimal later. Don't need this stuff. Don't even need to turn it off though, because we don't get a fast repair. So, I mean, if I'm coming in the pits, we're kind of just doomed anyway. But, E5's not too bad. I hope we have a reasonable turn one. All I ask is for good luck, guys. A reasonable one. Doesn't have to be a great one. It doesn't have to be a immaculate one. Just a reasonable one. <laughs> That's all I can ever ask for. We'll see if we get it. I don't do the advanced mods as much, so less uh, informed about how it actually usually looks. All time best must have been in draft or something. How did I get a 120.5? Why do people have so high rating, man? <laughs> Don't. <laughs> Racing races, I guess. We 
We're gonna look around, waiting for the start. We have number three. So we're supposed to finish on the podium, but we'll see about that. Gotta make it to the end, though, before you worry about finishing well. Finish first. Finish first to finish well. I don't know what I'm trying to say. One of those iRacing, like, little the blurbs before you start the race has, has a quote. So it sounds like that or something, but I need to stop. Pay attention. Green, green, green. Right side. Still there. Pretty slow through turn one. Kind of just took the outside lane. I think we made it around a guy. Starts okay. We're still in this. Don't need to be super aggressive or anything. Whoa. Pretty light on our feet there on these cold tires. Got it figured out though. Run into the back of anybody. Long race. Still pretty light on our feet. Gotta remember not to spin this thing on lap one or something stupid. Because it can be pretty easy when you're uh, not in the super stable rookie setups. These things can get kind of interesting. Overdrove that. Didn't hit the brakes quite as hard as I need to, but not a big deal. Hey, let's let one. Position. Checked up pretty good on the entry to the corner there. Let me get to this guy's bumper. Nice and smooth. We're just following the leader at the moment. Nowhere for us to go anyway. And no reason to battle and bring people behind us up to us, so... Content with this for now. Oh, what we got? Got some dust or something. Dirt. Maybe someone cut it a little on the inside. Go ahead and bring up uh, Session Optimal, so we're more familiar with what we're recently running. This guy's breaking earlier than I like to into this corner. Probably just stacked on each other, though. And nothing resembling a hurry. Just the turn in there. Just kind of having trouble turning at all. It's okay, we'll be right back up there. Hit the brakes harder than I remember. I guess I'm carrying more speed through there, and that's why I need to stab the brakes a little harder to get it slowed down to that final corner. It's a pretty tricky one, in my opinion. There's a pass going on ahead.
Still don't think we need to spend too much time side by side quite yet. So I hope they don't uh, feel the need to do that. Slow us all down. <laughs> it's a good, pretty good day. Remember to hit the brakes a little harder because we got draft. There's a feeling good though. Starting to get warmed. We got lap traffic already. I guess they must have had some trouble up there. Breaking very early. Why are we breaking so early? Oh my god, that's that's dangerous early. That's too early. Might have to get around this nine. He's starting to lose touch a little bit. And when he loses touch, we lose his touch. And me does not want to lose his touch. Mm, he's a little bit Looked like he was almost off the course there. He's got his left sides off in the grass. Not quite of enough of a run to try to get by him all. The leader's just done it. You don't remember he breaks very early. We're, we're still up there. I don't think we're losing touch. He probably just had a couple bad corners. That was a really bad corner though. Need him to get it together. sent me off. I've never had that happen before. That was interesting. Do that. That was weird. Normally I'm pretty good to eat up that curb a little bit there, but it kind of like shoved me off to the left. The leader's just done it. 121. I don't remember, we're going faster into turn one, so I can't quite break as early as I, or late as I normally want to. Maybe that's why they're breaking early, because they need to. <laughs> Wide there. Almost just accidentally got alongside him. Kinda did. Stay close, keep the pressure on. Don't really want to do that. Hey, 
right, I think we're gonna have to take this run here and try to get by him. Alright. Your lap time was at 22. Let's see how this goes. Keep to the left. Good pass. Nice front. Keep to the left. He's gonna fight me, so just letting it happen. Still there, hold your line. Back off. Clear on the right. The gap behind is now zero. Thank you. Oh, awesome. Awesome. Nice one. Alright, now we lost a bunch of time. Let's try to get back. Turn, please? Why is my car not turning? I swear it normally turns there. Usually when I turn the wheel, it turns. It didn't do it that time. Really bizarre. So, we'll see if we can pull away from the 9. Even with my mistake, we are now 0.7 in front of them. Kind of glad this lap car is here. Hey, that's Kazuki. That's the guy that made us wait. <laughs> oh my god, we just almost got killed. Okay then. Pass the guy clean, he tries to murder you apparently. I'm sure it was an accident. The gap to Backman. The head is increasing. It's now two point eight. Hey, drifting through that corner. I am kind of a mess right now. I'd like to get this cleaned up a bit. Catch up. It's leader, guys. 3.5, 2.8. And Lapgar in between. Pardon me while I put my wheel on my desk. They're having they have each other's draft up there too, though. But they are uh, stacking each other up as well. So a trade off. Okay, Colton. The lap times are pretty consistent. Seems like they're pulling away. Watch out, man. Yeah, I clipped the grass, sorry. Yeah, I'm not so sure I'm going to be able to catch those guys I had. I got to worry about the guy behind me catching me. It's definitely going to be able to catch a little bit here on the straightaway. That was a uh, 22.44. You know, we'll just, uh, we'll keep steady. We've got a solid third place right now. It's a horrible corner, I don't know what... I don't even know what I did wrong there, I just messed up. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. Plain and simple, you just messed up. All 
Alright, how much time we got? Still got 20 minutes exactly. I happened to look exactly when it said 20 minutes. That's funny. He's uh, kind of staying steady at half a second, although he's gaining a little bit now. Kind of pulling away ahead. Makes sense. They are the one and two. I am the three. So that all kind of makes sense now, doesn't it? Overdrove turn one. That kind of stinks. I think the lap car might have gotten into the sand there. There's just some parts of the course I, was, I could definitely gain a bunch of time on, and I think it's causing me to really lose the guys I had. It's definitely keeping this five behind me, too. Lots of time to go. Can't hit turn one right. I keep doing it differently every lap, and it's not doing me any favors. Okay, Colton, hold your nerve. Just keep it smooth. No mistakes. Maybe it's just an optical illusion. I don't know if the lap car really was in the sand unless it did it two times in a row. You got it, play car on the right. Uh oh. Thank you. That was I guess he let the leaders by. That's kind of what that was. You're halfway home, got plenty of fuel. The gap behind is now 0.9. So he gained a little bit on the five back there. That's good. Not the greatest corner there, though. Just trying to help him reel it back in, apparently. Spin it. Wow, that got really slippery. I just I hit the curb wrong and it almost killed me. Yeah, like I said, giving it back to the guy behind. Yeah, I'm just gonna mess up every corner now. That's gonna be my new thing. It's kind of my motif, you know. That's my signature move. Give away any sort of lead I have. It's kind of my thing, you know. Why are you breaking my draft lap car? This is breaking, I guess. I like this draft, but okay. Appreciate that. Kind of 
bold there. Fifteen minutes left, that's fifteen minutes. Do that section okay. Wait a little bit. Get five seconds ahead up there now. I can push through there so much harder, but I'm a scaredy cat. They could always run into each other up there. It's always a possibility. Never confident with that corner. I never feel like I can go through there and oh, hit it. Man. Nice. Given time. You've used half your fuel. Half fuel. That means we are probably. I hope. More than halfway through this race. A little bit harder through there, not so bad. The gap behind is now 0.8. That lap time was 22.44. I need to take that uh, corner a little shallower, I think. I feel like that wider line I'm doing is not quite it. So I was not brave enough through there that time. At least I can still kind of see him up there in first and second. Haven't run off into the distance quite yet. There's still time for that. Though at least for a while I should be able to at least see them on the front stretch here, long as it is. He's holding steady behind me back there. Definitely am not feeling 100% comfortable where I am. It's not the way to take that corner. I just missed the apex for no reason. Yes, good. Let's get in the sand. Perfect. Okay, Colton. We just cut the track. You 
We've got 10 minutes left. 10 minutes to go. Hmm. Need to get my uh, rhythm back. Lost my uh, smoothness a little bit. Not that I ever had much to begin with. Gained a little bit of a little chunk of time back. That's what I'd like to see. Ooh, some sand. Interesting. Not sure who did that. That was a 122.59. Okay, Colton, that's good consistency. Keep it up. It's like I've forgotten how to take turn one. I know I can be faster than that through turn one, but I just, I've not been hitting it the entire race. Great if I could do that. I do, uh, I do like Summit Point quite a bit, especially that whole section there. It's a lot of fun to race through. It's a good one for the Mazdas too, not too much draft. Which is just what kills Mazda racing for me a lot of the time. You go to Spa or like Daytona Road Course, way too much draft on those tracks for me to enjoy the Mazdas all too much, unfortunately. The car in front is but here it's not too bad. Clear on the right. Ah, uh, sorry, mate. Mm -hmm. Come on, mate. Defend your position. Had to dodge that. Thing I keep an eye out. Not sorry enough to give back the spot, though. Let's see if he, uh... Will once we get closer. It's all right. I'll take some draft for a little bit. You're reeling this car in. The gap's now 1.2 seconds. Time we got six minutes. Yeah, let's try to catch him back. Take it, you jump away. Take that flight. P4. Right side. Nice and we clear on the right. Good job. Well done, Colton. Great move. I hope you drove it trying to get her on the outside. Thanks, man. I appreciate that. an awkward exchange, but now it's like it didn't happen.
thought he was going to let me clear him in the corner, and that's why I ended up overdriving on the outside, because I had to kind of oh, change my course a little bit. But now it's like nothing happened. <laughs> He's pretty much the same distance behind as he was before. Before he, uh... Through the, through over the corner. I'm overdriving the corner and failing to speak words. <sighs> I need to stop overdriving. That's what I need to do. I need to pay attention. Stay within myself here. It's an all sense of drive. I don't know if my tires are giving me struggles or Alright Colton, hold your nerve, just keep it smooth. No mistakes. Go. Went through there pretty aggressive. Would love to not give him the chance to come back again, but he's like real similar in speed, and I'm blowing that corner, so. Oh, falling apart, man. Spot is very valuable, though, not just because it's podium, but because if those guys wreck each other up there, then. You're going to want to be in third. You've just done a 2 minutes, there's only going to be about 2 laps left, I think, now. Okay, not too bad there. There we go, that's what we need. What does that die for, man? <laughs> You don't need to bump me, mate. Oh, don't kick me off the course again. What was that one time I hit that I hit that curb? Just just wrong, I guess, and it sent me off. Is this last lap? Two to go, two minutes. Or two laps to go. If you're remaining. Ugh, a gross corner. Two laps to go, presumably. Your last lap time was at uh, 22.62. Did it again. You did it again. Clear. Car on your left. Clear. Oh, Colton. Come on, mate. Defend your position. Well, I couldn't dodge it that time. Cool, thanks man. I guess he didn't learn. I don't know, car doesn't want to stop. I think they have tires. Seems okay. One more to go. Keep it together. We'll be on the podium. Is he gonna kill me now? Oh, 
<sighs> well, he uh, made this hard on us to keep third. And it's now top 10 up in New England. Okay, I, have, I know I'm not saying much, I'm just focusing, I'd really like to get this podium. Uh, Alright. That's two minutes. Two minutes two minutes 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 time. Time. Just gotta not blow the final corner and then we're fine. <laughs> Good race, guys. Drive, that's a podium. Good race, a good win. It's actually been a nice race. Awesome nice race, yeah. run. Solid work. So we kind of got killed <laughs> in the third one. Two times at the end there, that kind of stunk. But, man, I had a good incident race going, too. Well, I guess speaking of, I might as well do a couple more corners. Since that counts. But we got a P3. Very happy with that. Take a look at the incidents here in a moment. P10 without any exits. Nice. So we do a cool down lap. There it is, alright, 44 minutes, that means it has trans transferred over into post-race, we will park it. Alright, that was a workout. Good number of laps there. Here at Summit Point, we got ourselves our P3, where we're supposed to finish apparently. Almost got killed twice. Actually made contact the second time, but thankfully uh, figured it out. And I'm sure we'll see it here in just a moment, as well as all the other stuff. So, lap one, we have issues already. It really looks like that guy just uh, pushed that guy off. That was kind of weird. I'm guessing he probably got unsettled under braking. I don't think he actually turned right into him. I think he hit the brakes, and he didn't even hit the brakes. Why did he do that? He just straight up pushed him off the course. Not paying attention, he just pushes the guy off. I was gonna say under braking, maybe he got unsettled, but brake lights tell all. And then this guy, there's nothing he can do there. He's on the grass, he can't control it anymore. So that opened up a nice little gap behind us. That explains where that came from. Loud. Wow, this guy's being a real jerk, huh? He's causing all kinds of problems immediately. So, it's this guy again. Comes up and hits him. That's two corners, two people he's wrecked. Three people he's wrecked. Not a great day at the office, sir. So he wrecks that guy, and then this guy's going around the outside. Oh, that's not code. That's what that was, but... Yeah, just put him off the course. He does not need to be out there, apparently. Not so great. So we're on lap three, so we, apparently lap two was nice and clean. That's a missed breaking point, and just destroyed the back of that guy. A little bit of bumper there. Three wide for 13th, I guess. Someone's just got to give there. There's, you don't need to be doing that at all. I'm, I'm struggling to even see who did it, but I think it's everybody's fault for being three wide in the first place, to be honest. Yeah, green kind of comes over a little bit, but I mean, the 
the real cause of that is just straight up being three wide. Smarter to back out sometimes, just saying. Whoa! <laughs> he just kept turning left. Didn't look like he was loose, but I guess he must have been. And then that is not a good place to hit the wall. Oops, blinking out too. So I'm seeing a lot of him. Oh, same story here. That one was a little more obvious though. We get going again. P6 going for the pass, and then well, the other guy just kind of runs into him, doesn't he? Oh, these guys are full. <laughs> Fists fighting. He's a million miles back. He does not need to be going for that like that. Like going in the grass to try to pass someone. It's pretty dirty. If you're in the dirt, it's dirty. And then they get stuck together for 10 hours. Let's go ahead and penalize each other for uh, racing like that. <laughs> and then uh, there's the one I couldn't avoid. So. First, let's watch the one that I did avoid. A good four, five car lengths back. I mean, he just misses his breaking point. He says, he says uh, his tires, I think he said. It's not breaking like he needs to, but. Goes through the grass. Oh, wait, what? That was the other one again. There. Here's the one we're looking for, so. Again, four, five car lengths back. What am I looking for here? Why is it not working right? I know he did it two laps in a row and I dodged one of them. And this is the one I didn't dodge. Was it? I guess it must have been two laps ago. I thought it was consecutive laps. I guess it must not have been. When did he do it the other time? Oh, he gives it back. That was several laps ago. Wow. For some reason in my head, it was like consecutive laps. Okay, but no, he's four lengths back here. Hits the grass. That's what happened. And then <laughs> I definitely overreacted a little bit. I just all of a sudden, yeah, I'm assuming he like dives it up the inside. I'm thinking he's like flying in from over here. I didn't realize he hit the grass there. I overreact a little bit. But that's because I thought he was flying in from this angle and never going to make the corner. But he was actually entering from a different angle. So that's interesting. But he gives it back. And then uh, does it again later. So now is when we get uh, this one. So this is the one where he does... I thought he did this both times, but he did it only this one time. And then he cuts across the grass and then right into me. Thankfully we had gained enough time, just being quick, to not lose anything. And then I have to pass him back. Legitimately. This time. At least I think. He might have lifted off. I'm not sure. But. He does that. And then we uh, just reel him back in. Pass him before the end of the lap. But I don't know if he was like. Kind of half giving it back to me again. I uh, certainly wasn't too eager to wait around for him after he did that. But that was it. All right. So uh, he's just racing hard. I don't blame him for it. He's just giving it all he's got. That's a racing thing. Like, it's not like he was being negligent. He was just pushing it hard and it didn't quite stick for him. So no ill will there. It stinks. I got a 4X from it. But, I mean, there have been worse. 
Anyway, that's going to do it for Advanced Mazda. Enjoyed the race. I hope you did too. Uh, got ourselves a podium, even after a heat-seeking missile almost took it from us. But uh, we're all right. And uh, I hope you have a good rest of your day. I'll see you next time.